You looked up, you saw the time. How excited were you? I was really excited. I mean, it felt fast, but it didn't feel that fast. <laughs> Blazing fast is more like it, as Dulles Viking senior Maddie Locus posted a pair of dominating victories in both the 50 and 100 yard freestyles at the Region 6 Swimming and Diving Championships, highlighted by Maddie's blistering meet record time of 50.23 seconds in the 100 yard freestyle. That was my goal all season and last season, but I just did it now and I'm really excited about that. My coach Allison always says that we do 5,000 yard kick sets in practice, so there's no reason I can't finish 100 with my legs, and that really pushes me in the last bit, so I think that was why. As the defending state champion in the 50 yard freestyle and the state runner up in the 100 yard free, Maddie has also achieved tremendous success outside of her high school competition. She has competed internationally for the U.S. Junior National Team and this past December finished first, as did her club team at the Short Course Junior Nationals in Atlanta. It's a pretty big beat. Uh, it's pretty fast. And um, the 50 free and the 100 free, I won barely. I won by a hundredth of a second in the 50 free. Um, and our girls team on our CST took the gold um, overall in the meet. That had to be really exciting. Yes, it was very exciting. With a training regimen that keeps her in the pool for over 20 hours a week, Maddie has put forth an immense amount of training and dedication in her chosen sport. Well, you really just have to work really hard every practice. You can't just slack off sometimes and sometimes work hard because each practice means something. and You always work on something different. How tough is it to, to stay focused and motivated and because it, 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 it's not easy? It's really tough. Um, sometimes I want to give up, <laughs> but I really just want to reach my potential. So I feel like if I don't give up and I keep working hard every day in practice, then eventually I'll get there. Maddie will swim for a national powerhouse at the University of Georgia this fall. She has also swam qualifying times for the Olympic trials in 2012. Earning an Olympic berth is certainly in the long-term picture as well. I think it's a goal for every swimmer, but there aren't very many people that actually get to go. Um, so yes, I'm looking forward to 2016. Uh, I don't know if I'll be ready by 2012, um, but you know, if I don't make it, then I'll just do my best.